These freezing temperatures we know could hurt our plumbing and of course nobody wants their pipes to burst. Nope, but sometimes they do, meaning plumbers are getting a lot more calls this time of year. Our Jude Binkley talked to a plumber about steps you can take right now to prevent your pipes from free freezing if you haven't already and you didn't do back yeah. in the fall. Jude. Well, Doug and Morgan, a hard freeze, which is a freeze that penetrates the ground, happens when it's below 28 degrees, and we've had temperatures at or below that point every day for a week now. People should have prepared their homes for winter earlier in the fall, but if you haven't winterized your house yet, it's still a good time to do so. Definitely when we get these first hard freezes, it ramps up, you know, being 24-7. We're running around like crazy for this first hard freeze of the year. Most pipes in a house are metal, and they can't expand. But water expands when it freezes. This can cause pipes to burst and could cause thousands of dollars in damage. It's the same reason why water freezing can cause potholes or cracks in roads. So how do you prevent your pipes from freezing? Keeping the heat on, that's the biggest thing. Justin Wardle is the general manager of Cloverdale Plumbing. He says keeping your house's heat on is the key to preventing a headache this winter. You can still turn the heat down, but it shouldn't be all the way off. And there are a few other steps to take when winterizing your home. You know, just make sure that your garage is staying shut. Um, you're getting your garden hoses taken off the hose bibs on the exterior of the home. Um, you know, if there's a well house or something that there's heat inside of those. Uh, another big thing, um, mobile homes, the skirting on the sides, you want to make sure that those are sealed really well and insulated and stuff like that. Foundation vents should also be closed, and if your water heater isn't insulated, use a space heater to keep it above freezing. But generally, the water heater is going to, you know, act as that uh, warming fixture out there. So to sum that up, keep your heat on even if it's on low, disconnect your garden hose, and make sure foundation vents are closed. Now, some other smaller things you should keep in mind during winter weather is to check your doors and windows for gaps, and those can be patched up with weather stripping. Mm -hmm. And also check your pet's water bowls if they're outside to make sure that hasn't frozen. Yeah, and it, they'll freeze quickly. Oh, now, yeah. With yeah, temperatures yeah, yeah, yeah. at one degree, whatever it's going to be. I think it's a good reminder that you should be doing this stuff in the fall mm -hmm. ahead of Just Get ahead freezes. of it. Yeah. Exactly. Thanks, Jude.